Hey guys, it's Corrales, and welcome back everybody to Mashinki! Just sit back, relax and enjoy, I was in a bush. And if you do enjoy, smash the like button, leave some nice feedback in the comment section, alright? This is not perfect by the way, but it's, it's, it's struggling. It's struggling. Hey, however, it looks nice, alright? It's, it's a stone bridge. How can you say no? Anyhow, in between episodes, I did some minor tweaks. Let me just show you. Not really sure that is visible in this view, but definitely in this. Winter has come, Jon Snow. So what I did, I did not notice that we had like a uh, forest outside Doncaster. So I did add this station over here. And now we should be having a train going back and forth, which is supposed to be this guy. And... Uh, Judging from my train system, it is not perfect, but it's semi-working around. There's not like a lot of blockage. Sometimes it's stoppage, but uh, <laughs> it works, I guess. And I'm happy about it, all right? Leave me alone. It is what it is, I guess. Okay, this is not something I'm proud of. Okay, this is a little bit of bendy, but it's... Hey, it works, all right? Let it be, let it be. In today's episode of Mashinki, what I'm gonna do... I'm gonna... Put in the GS2 into works. What is this guy waiting for? Oh, unloading. Okay, let me just see here. Does this operate? Okay, this guy waits. Let's see here. Let's just speed us up. That guy passes. Yeah, I mean, come on. Every, everything kind of kind of works. Or semi works at least. So we're gonna put in a GS2. And I've been I've been watching this. Let's just go into this view so we can see it more clearly. We do have a lot, and I mean a lot of people in Bradford. 930 to be precise. So I kind of thought like, let's connect some big cities. So we do have Bradford, then I'll be watching on this line over here. And down the line, I'm not talking about Buri. I'm not talking about South Tyneside or whatnot. I'm talking about Bournemouth. Bournemouth, I don't know. It's something, right? It's a mouth. We do have this city. And then if we continue down, we have Blackpool, which is technically not by the sea. But it should be by the sea, right? Because that's kind of like the the, the 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 party paradise. It's kind of like the UK Ibiza. Ibiza! But uh, it's in England, all right? So we need to kind of connect that up somehow. Bournemouth, Blackpool, and Brighton is technically by the sea. This is also a party paradise of the UK people. But it's not by the sea in this, in this scenario. I will, let's start with that at least, because I want to see the GS2 in action, all right? So first is first, let's go into build mode. So how do we connect uh, you, Bradford? What we do is kind of extend. We could maybe even use this train track. However, it's going to be a bridge up the road, which is gonna, not going to be super perfect. And we can't really do a perfect shape of this. Oh, we can do a bendy shape for the bendy people, if that's kind of like a thing. We can do a little turning point. Ew. Ew. No. Let's let's not for the moment. Man, can I can't I just do a nice shape? I can't. can't I, I wish I could del delete buildings. All right. I wish there would be, be a thing. Maybe there that is a thing, but uh, not in this scenario. And let's connect it up like this. So that train is going to be leaving Bradford Station. It's going to be going on this track up the bridge, down the bridge, and now continue to this. So where is? Man, Bournemouth is not really on the way. But let's start this. Let's demolish. Uh, a road you can demolish, right? Yes, you can. And let's build a beautiful station here. As you can see, I got a little bit of cash now because I've been playing a little bit of camera just to kind of purify the, the railroad system. We're going to make a little station over here. And what we're going to do... Why? Am I sounding like Sean Connery? I don't know. Should we extend that? We could maybe even extend that. First is first. Let me see here. Extensions and waiting room. Is that going to include the whole of Borneo Move? No. It's gonna miss uh, some people, but uh, it's 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 fair enough. It's it's good enough. I, I I mean, could have this here. Delete that platform here. Beautiful. The signal box, however, will extend the train st uh, distance a little bit, right? Or train station distance. But uh, let's not keep that. Let's not do that. Platform storage building. How about the restaurant? Capacity and income. Nah. Oh, you know what? GS2 is coming to town. It's gonna let's go fancy. Let's go all in on that. So let's see here. Whereabouts is this? Gonna go down here. To go down here. And uh, before we do anything else, let's do another secondary station next to it, just in case we're gonna have a lot of trains here in the future. Which we might. We might. We. Have, I have actually no idea how long the series will be. For the moment, I just want to see the GS2 because it kind of feels like 
We've done a lot of things we've could done in this early access and there's not much to it until they add more ages, more trains, more possibilities. Oh man, look at that. I won't say it's picture perfect because it's not, but it is as good as it gets, okay? It's gonna be a little bit of an eyesore over here. So that goes down here through Bordemov and now we need to extend that, Warrington. You seem to be big, but uh, let's go Blackpool, I guess. Man, Blackpool is super hilly. And there's not really like a good possibility to, to get a train station in here either. Because we would kind of, I want to grab the post office and I want to grab the whole town itself, right? So we're going to grab everything. But how do we do? The only thing I can come, come to mind is kind of like terraforming the whole city of Blackpool. So let's say we would terraform that down. Delete that road piece over here and terraform even more. Like I, I could, I guess, place it here, but that's going to collide with the building in the far end. So that's going to be a little bit mech. Let's say we would do, do this. Let's get the, the signal box. Yeah, I don't think that's going to... Let's get that. I don't think that's going to do much, though. No. We still can't grab that. And everything about this is to grab that. Man, how do we do this? Okay. How much does the restaurant cost? 100 bucks. Okay, we need to save up for the restaurant. But don't worry about that. We're gonna get that. Alright, so let's start at least with the waiting room for the peeps over here. Let's start like this. Let's start on small scale. Platform in the middle. Because that's gonna be a platform thingy. Going in the middle. Can't I just place... Okay, can, why does it go back to this view? <laughs> well, I, I don't know what I've done, but I take it. And then another station just next to it, like this. Then we're going to extend them by two. So let's just keep that in mind. So that needs to be extended because the, the, the box, the signal box is going to go in as soon as we've got that. And then it will go down. So it's going to be picking up a lot of people from Blackpool area. Now let's see here. This train track from Bornemuth is going to go in here. Ooh, caramba. It's not a really that... Uh, it's not going to be a thing, really. Okay. I, it's not a proud moment. In the train community. But um, it's a moment, okay? You gotta give me that. It is gonna be a moment. Alright, so that works. Then we can have another track going into that. So that is going to be it. And that means... You know what? Meanwhile, just... Just so... What? What did I do? Why did I... <laughs> I've made a pretzel! <laughs> Why did we do a pretzel? I don't know, everybody. I think I've misjudged the situation. The pretzel. Town of Bonnymouth. That goes in here, and just temporarily for the moment, we could maybe even connect them up like this. So we could have like two two ways going back and forth. Here would be an ideal place for a bridge, because that uphill battle is going to be a little bit of a struggle, I guess. But we're going to see how the GS2 will perform on this single track, going all the way from the city of Bradford, through Bournemouth, and go to Blackpool. We could maybe even extend, like we could have small train stations here and there and there and here, but uh, it's not needed. Now... Let's see here. Depot. We're gonna add that. Oh, we do have a depot outside of the city, right? Did we not have a Bradford depot? Okay, Bradford depot comes in, please. No, we could do. We could do this. If we extend that a little bit, right? Then we could technically put that over here for the moment. Put a signal box as soon as we have Ford and have a station extended a little bit more. But now, moment of truth, everybody. Oh, no, we can't. Yes, we can. Because what we need to do is that extension as well, right? The extension is going to be on a little plateau over here. <laughs> Just destroying the beautiful landscape. <laughs> extensions. No, 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 extensions to begin with. Hide everything away. This guy needs an extension. It's going to be the locomotive works. Oh, it's tiny. Uh, Just around here. And now I'm thinking. Let's Let's bring that down a little bit. Can I get reclaim the land? Let me see here. <laughs> I take it, okay? I take it. How is that possible? 
Uh, okay, everybody. I think we need to reconfigure the situation a little bit. Just here. Let me see here. Perfect. Everybody, you can't judge that. I mean, what a beautiful place to have the locomotive works in. I would live there. But now, if I buy engines, that means... The GS2 is open for... We still have the Porter Baldwin, the... Oh, this is new. The Russian is new, right? That is a new train. Russian. And the GS2. Okay, so we got the Russian. Okay, boom. GS2. Bought it. It costs a hell lot of uh, money to upkeep, I guess. No, it's just to upkeep. Then the wagons. Did that unlock... Let me just get this up here. Did that unlock... First class, second class, and a dining cart. Okay, so one, two. Why does this has a mail? Does this pick up mail as well? Hmm, interesting. We're gonna try without mail first, all right? So that is sixteen. That is thirty-two people. Let's add one extra. And uh, let's see here. That is that. Then we're also gonna have. Can I just get that? Uh, let me see. There we go. Perfect. Uh, oh, just two. Okay, so one more. Oh, I can't because I need to wait for cash. Crap, I didn't think about that. Can I speed up the game a little bit so we get the cash in? What the crap? What the crap? Okay, what is making... Oh, train 27 has stopped. Why you stop? Okay, you're moving again. 13 is moving in. Okay, yeah. Sometimes when they have to wait too long on a little, like, signal, they just get really upset. Oof. Oof. That works. What the hell is making the gold bucks? Or the wood bucks? The tree bucks. The tree tokens. I bet you it's gonna be like the two works. Is it? Yes, it is. From 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 timber. The only the only solution to the, the whole like, scheme of problems would be to make it more planks. To this guy because now we have only one train which carries them back and how full is how full is this guy it's fairly full by the way the extensions on the sawmill extensions employee quarters this is gonna be a thing a toy shop on-site gift shop allowing the sawmill to sell products directly okay that costs 50 tokens we don't have them then we have a storage upgrade, a steam sawmill, modern machinery which improves sawmill's production. Ho oh, ho, I can't neglect that. Put it in. And a drying storage, which also calls the gold bucks or the wood, wood tokens, which we don't have now. But we will. We will acquire them. Let me just hide everything away here on the side. I, don't. I guess we could have two trains, but no, that's gonna mess up everything. But we need some way to transport more planks into this guy over here. What if... Don't do it, Kralis! Because we already have two trains or three trains sharing the track or two. I mean, it would be a, a thing, I guess, somehow, in a world where one man is trying to build an empire of trains. A conspiracy of problems around here. Hey, we don't have to have the bridge. I fixed it, everybody. I fixed it. It's gonna be a roller coaster of a ride, but it would work. How about the bridge now? Will it still go up? Yes, it will. From here to here? I can bring it down. Yeah, the little... That's what I hate. It's the little, like, thing over here. How about we start b further back? Nope. Still gives us this little hump. So the only thing that means is that we need to start on one of those. And then bring it down. There we go. Perfect. Done it. Fixed it. Uh, yes, please. Build it. No regrets. That also means now we could put a train which just carries the planks back and forth, back and forth. Okay, why is there a stoppage over here? Okay, that train needs to pass. That goes out. That goes in. That goes out. Tw tw Twain. Twain 13 and 27 have a big issue with the signals over here. Which at the end of the day, I guess we need to adjust. We need to fix. 
But we're not there yet. No, we're not. Donkey. Are we there yet? No. Could we let a train out from this guy? Nah, that's gonna be a mayhem. Now, I'm just thinking about the depots. Like, if, if we play this, if we build uh, this up again one day, we would need to purify this so much. We can afford. Man, I just wasted all my gold coins. But that's the matter. We're here to earn those, right? Then wagons. We're just gonna have the, the timber ones. Or the, the planks ones. One, two, three, four, five. Did we buy five? Let's see. Zzz, five, six, and seven. That should do it. That should do us good. Add order. Go pick up the logs. Go drop off the logs. Back and forth, back and forth. Let's see the sweetheart rolling out. Oh, man. I like trains. I like trains. There's a lot of trains. It is a lot of trains. Look at that. He's got 49 timber. That should bring in the big bucks when it comes to, to this, right? Let's see here. He stops. He unloads. We should be starting receiving some of the the wood tokens and that we do in masses oh man this is amazing by the way the tool works and extensions on the tool works did we check them okay we do have a heating plant a furniture shop yes please there we go also some farm tool factories problem is we can squeeze that in here because of the train stations I've placed all over the place. Product storage would be a thing. That's the only thing I can squeeze in, I guess. Man, this would be kind of ideal, the farm. Well, in this area, we're not gonna have it, everybody. Lab. There's something special about trains. All machinery in general is actually really sweet. Perfect. That means if we move our butts back to Bradford over here and go into this guy, Wagons. Get some passengers in here right away. So we have... How many did we have? We had... Let's just extend that. We have two first class. I guess we can keep that. Have a dining car just in between them. And then have one and two of those ones. Maybe even three second class. And the question is, the mail thingy. Do we need that? Hmm. I guess we do. Let's add. Man, that looks so awkward. I don't want to have this guy here. Because you can see those guys. It seems like this here both serves passengers and mail. Which renders this guy's a little bit useless. All right, let's keep it at that. Let's minimize. Uh, zip. Let's slow down the game a little bit. And look at the gold, the wood tokens just rolling in. Orders on this guy. We're gonna go. Hide that away. We're gonna go from the beautiful city of Bradford to the beautiful city of Bornemov, which is along the train track. Man, it's far away. Here. Then we're gonna make a pit stop in uh, Blackpool. Not really a pit stop. For the moment, it's the Eden Station, right? And, oh, pick it. Pick it. There's only 515 people waiting in the beautiful city of, of Blackpool. Then on the way back, stop, stop in Burning Moth again. Back and forth, back and forth. But no time to waste. Pause the game for a second. Let's get our butts back to Bradford. And let's see this baby rolling out. Oh, man. Don't look at the wonky shape here in the railroad. What a freaking beauty. Okay, my platforms are not really made for this train, okay? Please excuse me. It is what it is, everybody. It is what it is. Are we reloading up? I don't think we will ever reach top speed on this guy, but let's see what we reach.
Okay, before we do anything else, let's just add a little signal. Hmm. I'd rather have it here and keep that train going. But there's nothing here on this track besides this guy now for the moment. He's got 107 passengers on him. Let's just jump in. Not so fast. Toot! It's a screamer! How do the first class... Can I go in here? Can I go inside of the, the car? Oh. Is this the first class? It's gotta be. Let me see here. Can we go into the dining cart? Is this the dining cart? No. Maybe it is. Yeah, this definitely looks like second class, right? This is second class. This is second class. Oh, this is first class. Is there any difference, by the way? Maybe, maybe there's no difference. Let me just go back inside. Hey, back inside. This looks posher. They don't have a table, so this got to be the second class. All right, there, there, there's, a, there's a slight difference. Oops, stop it. I mean, come on. Look at this guy. Let's just close them off. This is a screenshot moment right here, everybody. Wow, that train. Like this. You keep on rolling. Eighty-five, eighty, ninety miles per hour. A ninety-two. Ooh, what was that? Okay, that was like coming into burning off. Here's the time where I should blow a tooth, right? Because we're in the station. Just arrived. There's no people on the platforms. But there is people. Are we leaving? Toot toot! Yeah, it's not gonna be going up in speed. About 90 before we need to break. But it's such a beautiful sight. And the platforms are too, too tiny as well for the task. Oh man. So now we have this guy rolling about the lands of the Kerala's train empire. How many people do we have? We have a thousand people here. Yeah, we're not gonna get rid of them. I guess having having two of those would not be a bad thing. Problem is gonna be. Problem is gonna be. Collisions. Ideally, would be having two tracks going back and forth, like having those platforms used as separate tracks and having them going back and forth, back and forth with switches. Hmm. Man, I need to check that out. By the way, how are we doing over here? Because I mean, I see the money coming in. Do we have any issues with blockage and stuff? Those trains, let me see here. That passes, that waits, that goes past, that gets green light. That's not a problem. Still having some tr troubles on this part here. Yeah, it doesn't have to take any posts. It just takes passengers, right? Yeah. So we would need some something which carries the mail away from, from this place as well. Which kind of sucks, I guess. But what to do, what to do. And that's about it what we can do over here. How are we looking in Borimov? I guess we could extend some roads over that, just in case they want to build an upgrade. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, we don't really need to extend the train station over here. It would be a thing, but it's not necessary. And hopefully they will build around this now that we have a connection. We have connected them to the outside world. They are not in the wilderness anymore. Well, let's see here. This is working out great. Bradford is still kind of serving a lot of people, but it's gone down a little bit. We still have the mail situation over here. But yeah, here in Bradford, let's delete this guy, get an extension in, and get the, the platform signal box. There we go. And once more, station, extension, here, by two. So, so look at it. Is it nice? Well, I bet you it is. Can't we do it here? Station too large, all right. So you can only do that in the same same way, I guess. 
but it doesn't really matter that much. Man, we're doing fairly fantastic. 28 has stopped. Oh no, what's go? Oh, no, 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 no! Is that a trout? Yeah, it is this. Is this whole like scheme of problems? Stop it. Stop. Light. Signal. That should fix. Not that issue, I guess. Yeah, it does. Just has to wait on the train further down the road, I guess. Yeah, but it's still. This is a little bit silly having them here, to be honest. Like. Since they can't really pass anything else over here, so let's just have it like that. What a train! Alright, peeps, that's gonna do it for today's episode. Thank you so much for watching. We've set up the GS2. It is working. We're also getting a lot of tokens left and right. Oh, by the way, didn't we have the summon here as well and the tool works? Because we are just having a train transporting the, lot, the, 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 the things, right? If we would add, first of all, is this. Extensions to this guy. Extensions. Employee quarters. Because why not? We're going to have a little toy shop. Because, I mean, why not? We're also going to have the storage yard about here. Sawmill. Squeeze that in. And the drying storage as well. In the behinds. In the sides. Here. Is that all? This is fully expanded now. So that is set up, right? Then we go to this over here. This beautiful tool works. And we're going to do the same pretty much. We're going to have the heating plant. Here. The furniture workshop over here. The tool factory. The product storage yard. And that's every single upgrade we could possibly imagine on this guy. So he should be producing and giving us so much tokens back now. And it's going to be crazy. Let's see here. This guy... Uh, slow it down a little bit. There we go. That guy comes in. Oh yeah, look at that. The wood tokens. Coming in masses. That's perfect. By the way, did we... But yeah, we couldn't upgrade that guy. But this guy over here, on the other hand, where is he? Here. That, this tool works. Can we squeeze in extra upgrades? The toy shop, for example, now? Well, we can. But we can't do the drying storage. What a fun man. That is so cool just seeing all those trains all over the place. 26, to be precise. Yeah, this isn't something we need to fix. We need to fix all the signals over here and get the trains running as intended. But it's not a major problem. It's a little bit like a stoppage on the on the signs and whatnot. Other than that, I see everything is just moving out throughout the map. Thank you so, so much for watching. I'm Kiralis. Where's the GS2? We need to end on the GS2. Here. No, that's not the GS2. Where's the GS2? Here it goes. Here it is. Grab it. Zoom it in. What a train. Coming into Bordimov and collect my reward. Did I collect it? Yes, I did. What a beauty! Okay, everybody, we have some issues with trains. I'm going to fix that in between episodes, I guess. But the next episode, we're just going to expand the GS2 lines all over the place, transporting people left and right. I'm Kiralis. Thank you so, so much for watching. Have a very nice day. And until the next episode, bye-bye. What a train. What a train. <laughs>